Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brownie and I'm one half of the Indecisive Readers. Today I am here to announce a readathon and that is the special edathon. Um, hopefully you get that it's a play on special edition because it is a special edition theme. Readathon. I don't know about you but I'm really bad at reading special edition books. I'll pre-order them or just buy them because they look pretty or they've got sprayed edges or they just come in a subscription box. But then even if I'm really excited to read them, I kind of forget that I've brought them and they just end up looking pretty on my shelf and I never get round to reading them. So I thought what better way to get people to read them than creating a readathon. So that's what I'm here to do. I'm gonna run it in the month of August, mainly because when I asked people it was a pretty like even split between September and August and August is a better month for me and I've got some roles in my TBR game that it works better for so I'm gonna do it in August, it's gonna be very low key. I've created a bingo board with nine prompts and you can interpret the bingo board in any way you want, just read three and you get a bingo. So hopefully it works for you, I'm really excited for it and I hope you are too. I will just go through the prompts with you now. I've gone for very loose prompts, so just kind of prompts that you could probably find a normal paperback with some of these prompts. The first one is a book with foil in, for example, this one, I don't think it's a special edition, but you know, it's got foil in, it would count. The next prompt I have is a book with a redesigned cover. This can be completely redesigned, like this Fairy Loot exclusive of Fable, or it can just be a colour change, like this Fairy Loot exclusive edition of The Prison Healer. The next prompt has been made to help you get through those ones you've been meaning to read for ages, but you keep them off. So it's the oldest special edition you own, such as my Lumicate copy of Blood Air, which I think I've had since like December 2019. The next one is to get to those books you've just received, so you tick them off straight away. And for me, that's Witch is Steeped in Gold, which also has a redesigned cover. The middle prompt for the board is pretty vague, and that is just to read a special edition book because that's the point of the readathon, you might as well help yourself out. The next prompt is to read a hyped release. This might be a book you pre ordered because they were doing a special edition, or when a subscription box announced it, you were really excited. For me, I could read Star Daughter because I was so excited when Fairy Loot announced they were doing a special edition of it. The next one is for a book with a secret cover. As an example, I have Master of One, which is a Fairy Loot exclusive. The next prompt is a book you wouldn't have brought if it wasn't a special edition or if it hadn't come in a special edition box. An example I have is Shielded, which I wouldn't have known about if it hadn't turned up. However, it does kind of sound like my thing, so I haven't like got rid of it yet, but I haven't had the drive to read it, so this would be a good one for me to use. The final prompt I have is just simply to read a book with sprayed edges because so many books have sprayed edges. Hopefully you'll be able to sneak one in. An example I have is Such a Fun Age which has blue sprayed edges. So yeah, I hope you like the sound of it. It would be really fun if you were to join in. I'll post the bingo board on my Twitter and my Instagram so you can find it on there and use it yourself. Comment down below to let me know if you'd like to join in. Like I said, it's going to run over the whole month of August. You don't have to do all the prompts. You don't have to do three if you don't want to. It's just a fun thing. It's hopefully a way to get everyone to read those special editions they've been meaning to. And yeah, let me know down in the comments if there's anything else you'd like, whether it be sprints, photo challenges, a giveaway. I don't really know. It's the first readathon I've done, but I just want to have fun with it. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and I will see you in another video. Bye!